Canyon Springs. My name is Leslie and I'm the children's director here. Hey, if this is your first time here, we would love to connect and get to know you a little bit better. When you walked in, you should have received a bulletin. If you wouldn't mind writing your name on it and dropping in the offering plates at the back of the theater before you leave, that would be great. Hey everybody, did you know your kids are watching you and your every move, including what you do with your money? Do you have a good plan in place? If not, we can help you. We are putting on a seminar aptly called how to teach your kids about money. What a concept. It's gonna be held on Sundays, March 3rd and March 10th at The Cove, really easy in the afternoons. We're gonna give you the tools on how to set budgeting, giving, saving, and all that good stuff about money. Perfect for parents with preschoolers all the way through high schoolers. For more information, go to our website, gamesprings.org slash events, and check it out. We'd love to see you there, thanks. Back by popular demand, Hannah Branch is coming back to Canyon Springs. She is coming Tuesday, February 26th from 6 to 7.30 p.m. and she's gonna be talking to our parents of kids ages zero through fifth grade. She's gonna be speaking about your child's personality, your parenting style, and how to blend the two together great. So we would love for you to come be a part of that at The Cove, Tuesday, February 26th from 6 to 7.30 p.m. See you there. Hey, Canyon Springs, on February 10th at 10 o'clock, we have our annual congregational meeting, and usually not that many people go to it. So we're gonna up the ante this year. Uh, we're gonna bring in some extra food. It's gonna be between services at 10 o'clock on February 10th. And I wanna share my heart and vision for 2019. Uh, I'm excited about what God is doing in this church and what he's going to do in this next year to reach the next one. And I would love to share that with you. I'm gonna get kind of personal that day. So do me a favor, if you're a first service person, put it in your calendar to be there at 10 o'clock. If you're a second service person, put it in your calendar to show up early at 10 o'clock for our congregational meeting, February 10th. Uh, God's gonna do great things in us this year. See you there. Hey ladies, I mentioned a while back about the Beth Moore Living Proof event. Hey, it's not too late to register. If you go on to lproof.org and sign up for the Long Beach Conference, a group of us will be going there. So go there, sign up, and then contact Meg at meg at canyonsprings.org and she'll give you all the information about the hotel and lunch. It's not too late, sign up. So I am taking on a new challenge. I am going with the Freedom Challenge to climb Mount Hood in July of 2019. This is to create awareness and to raise funds for women and children who have been caught in trafficking or who are vulnerable to trafficking. Let me show you a little clip about what the Freedom Challenge is all about. We are a movement of passionate women dedicated to seeing oppressed and enslaved women and children set free. Globally, 24 million women and children are trapped in modern day slavery. And we are determined to do whatever we can to set them on a path to freedom. We do this by setting physical challenges and pushing ourselves to the limit. We walk, we run, we climb, we raise awareness and funds. We support projects that prevent young girls or vulnerable women becoming the target of human traffickers. Projects that develop long-term solutions to help women overcome poverty. Projects that actively rescue girls and women from forced labour or from the hands of pimps. Projects that restore dignity, that provide skills training and hope for a better future. If you would like to know more information about the Freedom Challenge, if you're thinking about that you would like to join me with this, check out our website, come to our first information meeting, and we'll get you all the information you need. All right, I got three more things for you. One, if your children are not enjoying the service quite as much as you are, I want you to know we live broadcast our service out in the courtyard so you can go out there for a better environment. Two, if you wouldn't mind silencing your cell phone so you don't distract those around you, that would be great. And three, you can check out everything that's happening at Canyon Springs by going to our website at canyonsprings.org. Have a great day!